Howdy, howdy, howdy. This is part two of uh, Devil's Tower. And I will be showing, we're going to be looking at some wood fibers to show you that this is actually tendon. This is not a tree stump. There's no root system whatsoever. And there would be a root system that would stretch way out into here to hold that up. Because if it was a tree, the roots are going to be attached because it's part of the cambium layer which provides all the nutrients for the tree and the cambium layer is the toughest part of the tree that's why you always see that's why you always see roots on a tree attached because it's the toughest part of the tree and this has none if you also notice from the top if you take a look from the top you will see that there are no annular growth rings there's no cambium layer there's none of that and there would be okay if this was a tree it would have to have a cambium layer and it would have to have the annular tree growth rings and it doesn't have any of that this is tendon and I'm going to show you see there's no annular growth rings there's none of that there's no characteristics of a tree and I know that these look like tree fibers and we're going to be looking at tree fibers we're going to break off individual pieces and look at it under the microscope and you will see what I'm talking about, especially when you look at them from the side and not looking straight on. Okay? So that's what we're going to be doing here in just a minute. We're going to get underneath the microscope and we're going to take a look at these individual fibers on wood. And you will see that it will look under um, a magnification glass and we'll also look under the micro electron microscope here that I have. And you will see that these are not tree fibers okay there's no there'd be roots on this okay there'd have to be massive roots cut out in here to keep it from blowing over in the wind I've been over that in part one but there is none of that okay there's no roots and there would have to be roots showing to keep it from blowing over in the wind and the side that had the because there, there's dominant wind on all trees and that and you have tension wood on that side and you have compression wood on the other side the tension wood is what holds it up in a dominant wind and you have no tension wood for the dominant side there's no compression wood there's no hinge wood there's no characteristics of a tree so we're going to take a look at that real quick under a microscope underneath these look at these fibers these right here and stuff we'll peel some off split them off and see what they look like all right sound good sound good to me too all right let's take a gander another picture here of the devil's tower you see how it's it's peeling off it has a coating on it the wood fibers I'm showing you have they have no coating they have none of this here that you're seeing and you'll see this in the wood fibers that I'm going to show you you don't see any of this going on there's no there's no no coating on it like this on wood fibers they're all individual fibers and I will show you there's thousands millions of these little individual fibers that make up one of these bundles or one of these fibrils okay millions of little fibers make up one of these in wood you don't see that here. There's more over here. There's a person climbing right here. A couple people. Wood fibers look nothing like this. And you're going to see that in this video I'm making. You're not, you, you see none of the wood fibers look like this whatsoever. More here. See a person climbing right there. The wood fibers I'm going to show you, they don't look anything like this whatsoever. They're made up of millions, well, in each one of these strands, they're made up of thousands and thousands and thousands of individual fibers. And you don't see any of that here. You see none of that going on here whatsoever, what I'm about to show you. Okay? Wood fibers look nothing like this. They're not structured like this whatsoever. This is what Devil Tower fibers look like when they break off and stuff. Nothing like wood fibers. Absolutely nothing. Not even close. And you're going to see that in this video that I'm making. I'm going to show you wood fibers up close. These all have a coating on them. Wood fibers are not made like that whatsoever. They don't have a coating like that that comes off. There's a person right there inside that one. Roger Spurs done. See, you can see the coating here. It's coming off. See that right in there? See that right in there? That's that coating. You can see it in through here. That's coming off. Okay, here's a picture of someone climbing Devil's Tower, those columns. And you see how this has got a coating on it? They have a coating. 
Wood fibers have none of this. They have none of this. And you're going to see that in this video. You're going to see where they have none of this. They have individual, thousands and thousands and thousands of individual fibers that make up one of these. And I'm going to show you. See, this stuff peels off. Wood fibers don't do this whatsoever. This stuff don't peel off. See this all peeling off? This is tendon. And that's the synovial sheathing on it that's peeling off. Okay? You can see it down in here even. You can really see it up here in this corner. See it all flaking off? Wood fibers don't flake off like that, alright? Alright, so we've got wood here, just like you see at Devil's Tower, with the piece, you know, the individual pieces. And you can see how they're attached and they point at one end because those actually tie into the next fibers next to them. That's what they would look like on the ends. Because all these individual fibers tie into each other for structural strength. So I'm going to peel some off here. Like this right here. We're going to break this one off. Just like Devil's Tower. Okay. And we're going to look at it from the side. And we're going to look at it from all the sides. So we'll be able to look underneath the microscope and see what it actually looks like. So that's what we're going to be looking at. Okay. Individual pieces. Alright, so let's get the old microscope fired up, and we'll take a look at this fibril. Alright? Alright. Alright, let's take a look here. So this is what it looks like from the side you would see looking straight on Devil's Tower. Okay, you see all those individual lines on the one piece itself? See them going up and down vertical? You see none of that on Devil's Tower. You don't see all them lines going up and down like that. Now when you look from the side, look at this from the side. Look at that. That looks nothing like Devil's Tower. See all these individual fibers on the fiber itself? This is one fiber that you're thinking is a, a, a tree fiber on Devil's Tower. But see all these individual pieces on it? You don't see any of that on Devil's Tower. Okay? Those are all individual pieces on it itself. See those? See this? See all this in here? You see none of that on Devil's Tower. Look at this over to the side. See that? These are all individual tiny fibers on the main fiber itself. Does that make sense? You see that? Now this is one fiber, just like you're seeing, that you think it is at Devil's Tower. Okay? And we're looking at what it really looks like from all the sides. And it looks nothing like Devil's Tower fibers. Or the tendon, they're tendon fibers is why. See all those individual fibers? Look at all them. Those are all individual fibers. Look at all these lines. You see none of that on Devil's Tower. And see all those spots all over it? See all the dots all over it? Thousands, hundreds of thousands of these dark spots. Now let's flip it over and look at this side. See how it looks right there? See all these individual fibers on here and all these strands? It's, it's layer after layer after layer of millions of little fibers that all tie it together. This is the corner of it. See the corner? We're looking at the corner of it right now. From side to side, corner to corner. And these are all just individual tiny, tiny fibers. They're all glued together, and Devil's Tower fibers have a coating on them, a sheathing. Nothing like this at all. And Roger Spurs is going to be doing a video on it. See all this over here in the corner? See these lines? See all these individual fibers? On the main fiber itself, one of those fibers, one of those 
tendon fibrils that you would think was a tree fiber. This is one of them, and we're looking at it, okay? From side, there's the corner, and there's the other side. And there's the tendon, there's a, there's, there's a, a, a piece of it right here. See that? This is actually part of another fiber that broke off with it. You see that? That's how they actually are. They're layer upon layer of these individual fibers. See those little fibers? Right here? See all those are all, those are there's millions of these little teeny fibers that you're seeing right here. And they're all overlapping each other. And that's what holds it together. And Devil's Tower has none of this. Because they're, they're, it's not wood. Alright, now see that? Look at that. That has nothing, looks nothing like Devil's Tower. See, there's some of the individual fibers right here in a bundle. And you see none of this on Devil's Tower. And there's the other corner. We're coming to the other corner. So I've showed you all four sides. See that? That looks nothing like Devil's Tower. Absolutely nothing like it. Because Devil's Tower is tendon. It's not wood. And there's no roots, there's no cambium layer, there's no characteristics of a tree on Devil's Tower. See all these, see these fibers right on, all along and right in here? I mean, there's millions of them. And they're, that's what sticks them all together and they become, uh, so they can flex and not come apart like a bunch of noodles. Okay. There's a bunch of them right there. See how they're kind of coming apart from the ones next to them right here? Those are all fibers. Devil's Tower has no fibers on the fibers itself. See them, see them all sticking out here like hairs? There's millions of these that make up one of these. All right, that's my evidence. Have a great day. Bye-bye now. And you're looking at wood right there, too. That's plywood. Looks just like what I just showed you, because this is the top of my desk with plywood. See? Same thing. All right, have a blessed day. That's my evidence that Devil's Tower is absolutely 100% not wood fibers. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye now.